Calling all tomboys. Now, just what is a tomboy? Well, according to Google, it's a girl who enjoys rough, noisy activities, traditionally associated with boys. And I think that most people think that this refers specifically to girls that get into playing sports, like especially football, because it's rough. Now, I was told that I wasn't a tomboy because I hate sports, but that isn't 100% true. I do enjoy horse sports, even though I haven't really had the opportunity to watch any, but I've grown up with and around horses, and I do enjoy them. I've ridden horses. It's it's a lot of fun. It's a matter of having the time to go out riding. And it's basically just trail riding, so it wasn't anything specific. Plus, I've never really been an athletic person, so that's kind of why I never really got into any sports. Because they always say you're either athletic or you're artistic, so I got artistic. Some people are fortunate to be both, but no, I'm not. Now, according to my dad, a tomboy is anything you choose it to be. And as a child, I loved playing outside and getting dirty. I didn't, I tried not to make too much noise because, I mean, yeah, sometimes I could get loud, like if I had friends over or something. But I did stuff like walking barefoot through the creek, play in the mud, play in my sandbox go down the woods and build a fort or just explore. So I kind of agree with dad on this. It's pretty much anything you want it to be. And I think another thing that defines a tomboy is a girl who doesn't really care for Barbie dolls or dressing up to look cute. And that's pretty much me. I had a couple Barbie dolls, but I very rarely played with them and I just traded them away. Now. I had My Little Ponies, but I grew up in the 80s, so I had the original My Little Ponies. And I loved those. Those were some of my favorite toys. But as far as, like, dressing up in dresses and stuff, I just, I wasn't in, into that. Like, I had doll clothes, and I think I got them, like, at yard sales and stuff, and I would just put those on my stuffed animals. That was the farthest I went to dressing anything up. Now, I'm kind of almost thinking that this just means that I'm half tomboy? I don't know. Because even though I really hate dresses and heels, I do wear makeup. As you can see what I have on now, it's pretty much the bare minimum. I don't go all out like some people with eyeliner, mascara, and all that. All I do is put powder on, cover stick under my eyes, and eyeshadow. And I don't even wear this to work. I wear it for my YouTube videos because the last time I wore it to work I got hit on and I'm like, no. I, I, hate I honestly hate being called cute, hit on, any of that stuff. So, yeah, I'm just... That that's really annoys the crap out of me. And occasionally, as you can see, I paint my nails. Like, when I feel like it. I'm just like... And, and the sad part is, I'll let it chip off till it looks really crappy, and then say, alright, I'll take the rest of it off, and then I'll leave them plain for, like, ever. And then I'll be like, alright, I feel like painting them again. So it's like, every once in a while, I will paint my nails. So yeah, there's some girly things, so I'm a little bit of both, so I don't know, Tomboy, tomboy or not, or half, what do you guys think? Also, my friends in school went through the stage of wearing ties, so I decided to just join in to have fun with it, and said, hey dad, teach me how to tie a tie. So sure enough, I know how to tie a tie, and yeah. The good way. Apparently there's a more fancy way, but I'm like, nah, just teach me the simpler one. I'm not gonna cheat and use clip-ons. But yeah, I can do that. I can do that much. And it was kind of a fun little thing. 
So if you want to see me wear them in more videos, let me know, because I have a whole box full of them that I bought off the Wish app. Because <laughs> I was like, I wanted to use them in something, but I never knew what to use them in. But anyway, what's your idea about uh, tomboy definition? Are you one? Or are you part one, maybe? I don't know. Let me know in the comments, and I'll see you guys next time.